11 games down in the low country here in South Carolina. One left to determine the champion of the Charleston Classic. It's Florida and 18th ranked Xavier. Here's Blackshear. Lewis with the burst to the rim. Falling out of the top 25. A 4 and 2 start for Florida. Count the basket. It's Paul Scruggs, the junior from Indianapolis. And Bill, Indiana, trying to calm his, his crew down. And you're right, little butterflies in the building. Six total turnovers between these two teams. The front part of the court so that he can have room to see and use that big 6 5 frame to get by. Oh, what a lob! And there's Tyree Jones to stop it. Just gonna hit as much resistance as he has felt this week tonight. Noah Locke, a terrific three-point shooter, starting to heat up in Charleston, has got his first. Zach Fremantle in the game. Oh, good duck in. There's terrific Marshall. play. Great design out the ATO. There's Quentin Gooden. They're able to swirl around one defender. Out to Marshall. And the leader goes down. Four, he leads Xavier in scoring. Quez Glover right here with a shot for Florida. This is a point guard. Marshall, 6'7 and long. Noah Locke. There's his second triple, and he hasn't hit the rim yet. The ball. Here's the senior. Marshall, head fake and drive to the rim. Sweet move. First time in a week. Here's Trey Mann, the freshman, who's back after suffering a concussion against UConn up at Gamble Pavilion. How about the slithery move from Keontae Johnson? Here's Gooden. And he's got the three. He's due. He's a tremendous facilitator of what Xavier likes to do. And so is Andrew Nembhardt. Of what Florida likes to do. Great decision right there by the sophomore point guard. A little bit more. You can get that shot in the time. You can break off the play late in the shot clock. Good and leaves it for Jones. Yeah, count it. Step out and take a shot. 12 paint points to Xavier. It has the advantage inside the lane. No after timeout percentages, but it's very high. Good cut to the rim, and it's Johnson. Nem hard leads his club with nearly six assists a game. He's got a great backdoor look against the pressure and the overplay of the Xavier defense. Scrubs, he has the capability to take over a game. Go back in. So is Jones. There's the one more to the corner. Scrubs. Turn, recognize he had some space and scores it. Game like this, that's going to be a one or two possession game. Winner is the Charleston Classic champion, oh, that's Tyree amazing. Jones. That's a Jones with two. That's it. Amhard with a tough angle. Johnson with the offensive rebound. Oh, he swims in with a score. So it's not a delay, it's a foul. It's the first foul on Blackshear. Long two for Noah Locke. Like Florida saving their man. Instead, Scrubs. Shot! Rejected by Lewis. Marshall got it. And a 10-point lead for Florida. Scotty Lewis. The six foot five freshman leads this team in blocks with two big ones in the first half. Here's ahead by 10 at the break. Miss. Well, it's going to be physical here in the second half. Xavier's got to stop turning the ball over. They have 10 turnovers in the first half. And no lock with an easy dish to the rim. 65% for the field. Open three, Scrubs got it. Jones on Nemhart. They're gonna clear it out for him. Nemhart lets it fly. 
And I think Nemhart has a perfect combination of both. Maybe two in a row for Scruggs, yes! Nemhart left wide open. This He's got another. That's how high level this game is. You make a mistake like that and they've made two and it's cost them six points. Jones recovers nicely. Lock. Yes! Friday against UConn. Needed overtime to beat Missouri earlier this year. Now find itself down by 15. Make it 17. There's Keontae Johnson's first basket of the second half. I'm into the post up on a front by Jones and still elevate over and score. Yeah, count the basket. Well, how? His players had moped after those two losses, falling out of the top 25. The practices were still intense and engaged. Two points to begin the game. Make it six. He's still stuck with six. There's the freshman Fremantle. How big was he of the game? Now the Musketeers back within 10. Blackshear spinning, finishes. Scruggs with the drive. Good defense to cut him off. Marshall oh, with a great feed to put in. It's going to be a fun battle between those three at the top of the Big East in conference play. How about Scruggs fading away? Points. He's got a great balance about his game. And the foul. You can't catch it any better. 6'9", 240-pound load, but he just got beat by Chris Glover. So the Gators had that 17-point lead. It swelled to that much. Now back within 10. That shot was blocked by Scruggs. Johnson goes to the hole on the left side. He uses his right hand. Glover knocks it down. Spot Blackshear. Good vision. Really just batted that one to Scotty Lewis. And he blocks this. Florida ball. The Gators with the momentum. Xavier's been in disarray a few times on this end. And that's Colton. So Payne clearly trying to deny that one on the way down. 22 tonight for the junior from Indianapolis. Now Glover with the speed burst. Wow, he just blows by. Just got to get going. Has it scored since the 12 minute mark of the first half. Scruggs, a little leaner, 24 points. Here's Marshall. Hasn't scored since the 12-minute mark in the first. To Gooden, knocks it down. Timeout Xavier, and it's a five-point game again with 2.07 left. Tonight, 79% on the season. He's got it. He set the screen. To Gooden, he just hit one from there. And another! I had a feeling that young man was going to have a big game tonight. Scruggs. They're going for a three. They didn't call timeout. Scruggs, Wide open. he's open. And Blackshear's got it. Foul with 7.5 left. One and one. Two possession game. Gaysville Sports Center after college basketball. ESPN of the ESPN app. Mike White uses the timeout. Game. Good in. Passes. A lot of time coming off the clock. And Florida wins the Charleston Classic. Physical, high energy battle. Xavier erased a 17-point deficit, came all the way back, but it was Florida who hung on. 3-0 week in Charleston. And this team brings a little momentum back to Gainesville.